In today's episode, we'll be preparing for Cosmonautics Day in Tanky Online. We'll also be talking about protection modules and informing you about a space event. Hello, tankers! One holiday replaces another, and it cannot be anything but fun. A new Cosmonautics Day event starts this Friday and lasts until April 18th. We have prepared many special missions for you during this time. Complete them and you will receive stars for your challenge, shards for containers, and ultra containers for completing the super mission. By the way, don't forget that you can get a new protection module and new augments from an ultra container. And of course, the discounts. Today we have a 30% sale in the shop, tomorrow in the garage, and Sunday will give us a 30% sale on upgrades and 50% on their speedups. You will also find festive decorations such as billboards, parachutes, and meteorites in the matchmaking maps. Don't forget to visit the garage to try the lunar soil paint on your tank. Many will be pleased with a new game mode, Hopper Ricochet on the Madness map. There will be an increased chance of the gold box falling out. This mode will last the whole weekend, and the weekend from the 16th to 18th will be accompanied by the Hornet Railgun mode. It's time to talk about protection modules. Let's start with a backstory. The number of protection modules in the game has not changed since the day they were attached to the paint. Back then, we had no more than 9 turrets in the game. You could take protection from a third of the turrets at a time in any battle. Over time, we released more and more turrets, added new protection methods such as drones and overdrives. The impact of the protection module system has been decreasing all along. We now have 14 turrets, with a 15th on its way. Recently, we added a new protection module, Armadillo. However, we were not sure if the game needed this new module. Protection modules reduce the effectiveness of the turrets in the battle. If there are too many of them, the game will become very slow, and it will be possible to destroy opponents only with the use of maximum boosters or specialized status effects. The need for an extra slot for protection modules is long overdue. We weighed up the pros and cons and decided we could only add one more slot for protection modules. We do not think it would be possible to add a fifth or subsequent for the current module system. So how will it work? With the release, the maximum number of modules that can be installed on a tank will go up to four. We will add a mechanism to the module system that will allow us to unlock new slots for tank horns. Only one slot will be available for beginners. This will make it very easy to become familiar with the protection module system. Tank coins are used due to the limited earnings through challenges and weekly missions. This sets up a clear progression for the player, who will eventually unlock all the module slots. For the players who joined us before the release, we will give free access to the usual three slots, with the option to unlock the remaining fourth slot for tank coins. In honor of Cosmonautics Day, we are ready to present a brand new event that has never been shown in Tanky before. It's a fascinating game, where you can fly through space and collect a lot of useful in-game items. It's similar to a board game, with dice, chips and a large field. However, you have hopper instead of the chip, you have energy and a radar instead of the dice, and the field is a borderless space, with planets where you can stop by. And to make it even more interesting, we have prepared a comic book worth reading to understand how Hopper got into this dimension. You can stop the video now, head to the description below and click on the link to register. Ok, and now a few rules. The game will take place on April 12th to April 29th. From this period of time, Tanky Online will receive a new resource, energy. All earned energy is needed to move Hopper forward on the field. You can see the amount of energy you have from April 9th where you can collect them by purchasing special offers, tank coins, and premium in the shop. Plus, special dailies and special missions will begin on April 12th. A special mission appears once a day, and if you do not complete it, the next one will be unavailable to you. For example, you missed the first two days. Then you will only see the mission of the first day. Completing the special mission will open the mission of the second day. But unfortunately, the daily missions for these two days will disappear, and so will the energy. Therefore, we advise you to enter the game every day, because you can get hundreds of tank coins, thousands of crystals, ultra containers, and the main prize of this mini-game, Crisis Drone. We will prepare a video instruction by the release of the game, where we will once again tell you the rules. We can only wish you good luck, so let's go and get Crisis! Welcome back to YouTuber Digest, our weekly selection of the best TO videos created by players. How did you spend your time during the Easter celebration? 
Watch Jordan as he shares his epic gold box montage from the recent event. Newbies also enjoy catching gold boxes. Watch Mr. Gauss's version of a gold box montage in the low and middle ranks. That's it for today. You know what to do here. Don't forget to comment. We're always waiting for your questions and thoughts. See you in a week. Bye. Last time, you had to guess which paint is not a parkour one. The correct answer is three. Congratulations to the winners. And here's the next question.